pajama, from Matias to pajama. It exactly. sounds a little bit Spanish or so. Yeah, like people expecting always like a guy with a sombrero. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, They never yeah, see like absolutely. a picture of me, they're always like, okay, who's this guy? That's not the guy. Oh, okay, you're the pajama? <laughs> Ooh, where's your sombrero? <laughs> what was you like in school? Were you the cool kids or you're the rebellious one or you're the mm. naughty boy in, in class or? oh that's that's a good one <laughs> i think i was just in the middle I, mm -hmm. I was not the best and i was not the worst no. i was just there did you do your homework though mm. yeah mm. like before school five minutes before <laughs> or on the way to school <laughs> there was a girl next to me she was really nice yeah. and she yeah. always said do you have it i said no did you get Here anything you for her mm. no just Thank you. Yeah, thank you. How, uh, you start DJing when you were 17. Mm. That was Actually, like... earlier. Okay. Yeah, I was really impressed by my neighbor. He always had his window open, and I always heard some, some music. Yeah, yeah. And I was wondering, what is he doing there? And then I <laughs> entered his room. He was just like standing there and mixing uh -huh. and scratching with turntables. And I was uh -huh. so impressed. That I came home and I said to my mom, do you have a Christmas present already? Oh, no? Right. Okay, buy a turntable, please. Do you play games? Oh, not really. I'm like, you know, I used to play football for 12 years when I was young, or 10 years. For yeah. a club or just for mm, fun? Or? Yeah, for a small club. And I also played table, table tennis. Ping pong. Yeah, yeah, table ping -pong, tennis. Yeah, whatever. ping pong. Yeah. Uh -huh. That so was fun. That was actually better than playing soccer. Okay, but do you, do you have any favorite sports team, though? I was a... Borussia Dortmund, you mm -hmm. might know it. <laughs> yeah, he said it's good. Yeah, uh, whenever we have like the championship uh, or something, uh -huh. and there is a game, I'm always the guy like who said, okay, I'm, I can't go like on the streets na being naked because everyone is watching football and you're just like the only guy on the street. It's so amazing. And I just like to be like, uh, I mean, I've never done that, but you, you could do it in Germany. You should. Yeah, Probably gonna do it. for fun. It's going to be next for year. Fun. For your 30th birthday, yeah. you should do yeah, it. Yeah, I should do it. I, I think I'm not a real German because I don't like beer. In Germany, you don't drink when, beer. Yeah, whenever I come somewhere, there people are like e even the guy who picked me up here uh -huh. at the airport, he uh -huh. was like, I have a water for you. But I thought maybe a beer is better. And I was like, mm, no. no. Because all the guys expecting like Germans of to course. be like a big beer drinker yeah, well, with a big belly and, no. and I'm not. What would be your favorite curse word? My favorite what? Curse word that come out from your mouth. Oh yeah, I'm, 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 oh. yeah, I have something. I'm uh, playing a lot in Italy uh -huh. and they always say fanculo. That so, means like <laughs> fuck or asshole or whatever. And it's it sounds so funny yeah, that I picked this up. And I'm always that like, ah, oh, fun like, like, like curse word. No, it's at fun. All. It's 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 fun not culo. it's not like a bad word. It's like with a, the hand as well. Yeah, they're always culo. like fun yeah, culo. A, and I'm, culo. yeah, I'm always doing it because it's <laughs> it's, it's like it's bad, but it's fun. So if you say like fun culo, yeah. people are not like, ah, oh, they won't feel offended. They're, they're okay. That's yeah. fine. Yeah, but still bad. It's yeah, still that, bad, that's, that's cool, but yeah. people who, who cool. listen, who, yeah. when if we address someone, some Italian guys see it now, they're gonna love it. So you never been in trouble. Have you ever of course, been in trouble? Yeah, when I was younger, we, uh -huh. we were playing football uh -huh. and we were always, um, like, how, how can you say, it? we crashed some uh, glasses, like big glasses, like this, with the football. Oh. But the day after, like, I was like, oh shit, what have I done? And I went to the police, like a little boy, I'm so sorry, I, it was me. And they were like, okay, that's fine. Yeah. What's the most played song on your iPod at the moment? Oh. The one that you. I think sing it's one of Flume's songs. Oh, oh Muramasa. You should check that. Yeah. Okay, I'll check that. And you it guys out. too. I I I come from hip hop. I came from hip hop. Yeah, I love it. Oh. Yeah, I like the really. I don't like the hip hop. Like I think you call it R and B, right? Uh -huh. When when the guys like crying and I don't <laughs> like. The, I like more like the I don't know ten years old. Mm, I got a lot of respect for Kevin Harris. I mean, he even sings and yeah, I mean. Can you sing? No, I wish. Uh, you sure? Have you not. tried? Yeah, and, uh, when I was in shower, in shower, <laughs> it's shower. horrible. Even the neighbors are closing the doors. <laughs> like, whoa, well, he's taking a shower. We should move. Yeah, but Kevin Harris is one of one of those guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, he's super else. talented. Uh, of course, Singer, Dre, Dr. Dre, it's cool. Mm -hmm. I like Rihanna. Mm -hmm. It's pretty pop, but it's I really like her voice. I think I don't have even one EDM song on my phone. It's just like hip hop, rock, pop listening to whatever well, I like, yeah, everything. Kind of.
Yeah. So what's Even the some Justin Bieber song. Oh, perfect. I, don't care. Yeah, yeah. I like it. I used to have a girlfriend for five years almost, but we just broke up. Like, I mean, not just, but like a year ago or something. I'm still good with all my ex-girlfriends. Yeah, some people don't get it, but I, I yeah. really like that. I mean, we were like in a we were a couple for so many years. So why should we having a fight now? I like That's that spirit. Reason. Yeah. Um, what is the best piece of advice when you start DJ that you get? I don't know. Like my mom always said, like, oh no, don't do it. Come on, he's going crazy. He wants really? to DJ. Yeah. Oh, so it was a pretty hard work for you then. Yeah, the it beginning. was. And you I was always like, okay, I, w I will show you. That's gonna be good. Uh, but a good advice, I never really had a good advice. But I would have good advice for younger DJs now. The most important thing is be unique. Do something what nobody has ever done before. Like trying to find a new way of, I don't know, even if it's just mixing or producing wise, find some a sound what has never what you've never heard before or something. Be unique, don't follow like a Hardwell or DJ Snake just because oh. they're popular because mm -hmm. you will just always be in the shadow. Is there any skill that you would like to master? Yeah, like I said, I would love to be like a master in making sushi. I would love that and I'm gonna do it in 2017. To I'm gonna jamo. get some, yeah, to jamo, sushi, master. sushi <laughs> yeah, that's, <laughs> that's gonna be good. I mean, you can do sushi, but most of the time it looks horrible. <laughs> <laughs> and I want, I want to make it like looking yeah. super good. So, well, how do you describe yourself in three words, then? Tall, funny, sometimes, when I'm not tired. Sometimes? Oh, so tired. you're tired now. No, I'm good. Oh, I'm not funny. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. And always hungry. So tall, funny, always hungry. So... Where did it all gone? All those food. I mean, um, that's why we have the pillow here, <laughs> so I can hide so my belly. Hide it. <laughs>